Yesterday we filmed Last Leave Monster Truck and well, we ended up crashing my monster truck and getting it stuck in this huge mud pit and it even catched on fire. Kill it, kill it, kill it, it's on fire! So today we're gonna try and pull it out. Wish me luck because I'm not sure if this is gonna be possible. The biggest truck ever is stuck in the front pond. Yo, last one in is a rotten egg. <laughs> come on. I mean, I think it's been a tank and it did a good performance down there. I mean, it was gonna come out, it seemed like. Oh, this is so crazy! It was close, but, but instead it caught on fire. Thought, I, yeah, it looks like straight up lava. So we tried, we thought the monster truck was gonna easily make it over that 20 foot little pond, but it caught on fire. Now it's stuck. <laughs> and it stopped moving. Thanks for the interview, so no problem. <laughs> Why is it when I'm not here, something lights on fire? That's my favorite. It was pretty scary. It was pretty scary. Well, we got all the big boy toys out stomach, like, to try sick. it. So we're trying to pull out the monster truck, and we have the dumpy and the other monster truck, and we'll see what, how much pulling force we need to get this thing out. Look at what he's wearing. What are you laughing at? Look at this thing. That's yeah, that's a handsome fella. It's an absolute bib. I just got in the lake with it, and there is a giant hole right about here. It's right. So oh boy. It's gonna be a little chilly in there. <laughs> okay, Jack, get in the water. Okay, so I guess the plan is Jack's gonna climb in there, try to rig up to the <laughs> rear, so then we can tie a tow rope from there to this, and then this will pull that way, and hopefully this will then come out. I don't know. It's gonna be kind of interesting. No, the plan is Jack goes in the water, and we point and laugh while he tries to move him by himself. <laughs> no, this poor guy. I can't believe you got it stuck in here. It was dripping lava. Kill it! Kill it! It's on fire, it's on fire, get out of there. It was pretty wild looking. Yeah, I mean, that thing is stuck stuck. I think you should leave it. What's the worst that happens if you leave it? It sinks deeper. Yeah, we gotta go scuba dive for it. Yes, Jack, come on, Jack. Let's go, Jack. Oh, that was a squirt. So how did this become Jack's job to go in the water? He's cut the waders. Yeah, Jack last night said he owned waders, so. Oh, Jack, 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 yeah, I was, I was oh. about to say, watch out for the tire ruts. Oh my gosh. Yeah, watch the tire out. ruts are deep. Yeah, the tire ruts. And what sucks is there's a perfectly good strap on the back of the truck. It's just totally shredded. So it got ripped into not, many pieces. Well, then it's not perfectly good strap then. Well, that part, the part you can see is perfectly good. Uh, okay. So who's driving the truck out? I don't think this is gonna come out. You think so? I don't think so. Unless you gun it that way. One foot for the other, Jack. <laughs> Let's go. Baby steps, Jack. Just remember, Jack, you're the real hero. I don't do that. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> Dude, you're living up to the waist. It's a pretty crazy shot right here. Oh, no, 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 Fallen. If we lose Jack, we'll have to. There'll be two recoveries. There it is. Mission success. Okay, that's a long strap. I mean, the truck looks small down there, Ryan. You're gonna, dude, you're really gonna have to flip it around and go that way. It's literally, that's <laughs> literally not going to work. Dude, I don't I mean, know. We should do a video where Ryan controls Matt's life for a day, especially when it's like with mechanical stuff. Yeah. <laughs> I think it's a good idea. Let's start that right now. We should. Hey, yeah. Matt, flip this car, uh, this, this truck around and let's go that way. Then we're just gonna yank it full speed down the driveway. <laughs> yeah. Wouldn't that be fun? That one looks so majestic. Look at it. The big one? Yeah, look how majestic that looks. Yeah. All right, so which way are you going? Uh, That way. I guess I'm dumpy. just gonna drive Dumpy into the mud. So how do you want to do this? Do you, we don't want to try and start it now? I mean, I think this is it. We just pull it out. Should work. Nothing can go wrong, so. Nothing can go wrong? No, it's nothing. I would love it if Matt just fell in the water right now. Man, this old girl is deep. She is Deep. Please fall in. Oh my god, Matt, I will pay you 10 bucks to fall in. Do you think this is about to work? <laughs> oh wow, that, you got that on camera? Yeah. Woo. Oh, easy. <laughs> that was scary. Is it gonna... Woo, baby! As long as she doesn't catch fire, she lives. Let's go. So the plan's gonna be pretty simple. He's gonna drive the monster truck, I'm gonna drive the dump truck. We're gonna drive them together and they pop right out. Nothing can go wrong, that's gonna be perfect. We got Jack on standby. It's dripping really bad. It's dripping really bad. Did it just turn off? It's dripping really bad. Might have done more than overheated then. The transmission might be totally broken. All right, we pull this thing out or not? We probably shouldn't try and drive it out because if these, this exhaust gets hot again, that fluid is just gonna catch on fire again. Don't worry, I got a fire extinguisher. I always wanted one of these. So that's the problem, all that color down there. Something's dripping. It's what? That's transmission fluid. Oh boy, so yeah. the transmission's probably... Yeah, oh I can smell it now, it's transmission fluid, yeah. Oh boy. I hate the hate smell it. of transmission fluid in the afternoon, I hate it. You still smell it? Oh, it's hitting me good over here. It doesn't... Oh, oh my god! Okay, it does not smell <laughs> that bad. It does smell really bad. That's oh. the underbelly of a monster. It's better over here. It's. No, leave him. 
Come on. You think neutral, it's gonna come out? I'm gonna find out. It's not gonna come out if you don't go start doing right, it. Then go, here. All right, sounds good, let's try it. I'm just gonna do the first part, Ryan, it'll be fun. There, it's not broken anymore. So I'm in dumpy cam. Drop this thing into one. Oh, that tension came out a lot faster than I thought. Woo. Okay, this is gonna be a pretty big feat. Oh boy. That didn't bug with it. Oh my gosh. That didn't do anything. I, I did move, I did move back. There's this much now showing on the tires. I feel like we gotta get your tires spinning. Well, do we wanna just top it up and then just run it and pull it out? We can keep dumping fluid in, but eventually this is gonna get hot again and it's gonna catch on fire again. So it can't come out of here under its own power is the problem. Well, I don't think we can pull it out with not its own power. Well, we have bigger issues. The monster truck actually is broken, not just stuck, which means we can't drive it out, which means in order to pull it out, we need way, way more pulling power, multiple times more than what the dump truck can do naturally. So we actually might be ca calling the barber boys. <laughs> What's your plan? Why you, he comes over here and just punches me. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> that, was the, that was the plan. Just that knock me plan. unconscious. I got a plan. <laughs> a plan for the monster truck? Nah, just Next punching you in the face. Yeah. I don't think I've ever seen Matt move that fast. Oh man. So Andrew really did break. He blew <laughs> He blew up the monster truck. Luckily, the same things used to put a Ferrari in a tree can be used to pull a monster truck out of a mud pit. <laughs> Should we use the Ferrari to pull the monster truck out oh and God. just completely reverse it? Shouldn't we use the monster truck to lift the Ferrari into a tree? This is the definition of teamwork right here. Everybody is working together to get this thing out of here except for me. This is gonna be cool. Oh, I still smell that thing wafting up here. Yeah. Oh. Can we throw a firebomb into the water and see if it like lights? The smell was my life while I was working on that truck. Is that why you're like this? Yeah. It's not, I will say it's not the worst smell in the world, but it's not a good smell. No, it's not like gasoline, which I love to smell. Yeah, like some weird things like are like good for some reason. Yeah. This is like a weird thing that's like not that good. Kind of like, <laughs> kind of gross. Yeah. You wouldn't think it would, oil would have such a, a belly of the beast kind of smell. <laughs> I feel like we're inside a whale. <laughs> it is. Like, the monster truck actually, like, uh, whatever you're imagining is exactly how it smells. It's like mechanically, but also like it's got some like BO to it. <laughs> some BO. Some bad odor, dude. Matt's taking charge here and he has a new plan of how to get this thing out. We're moving the dump truck around. We're bringing the cables out, the pulleys. This is the same exact rigging and materials that we used to put the Ferrari up into a tree. But we're kind of doing it, instead of vertically, we're doing it horizontal. So we're doing a gear reduction with these pulleys. For every snatch block or pulley that we use, the gear reduction doubles. So if we're doing two, we'll get twice the pulling power. If we do three, we'll get three times the pulling power, which will just basically make this be able to pull stronger and stronger. And that's what we definitely need. The downside to all that is the more cable we have. And so we're limited on cable, so we can only gear it down so much. Oh, look who is, look who decides to show up to the party. Oh my goodness. I can, I can probably squeeze around right here. You're trying to leave or join and help? I'm trying to leave right now. I gotta go film with uh, with Fortnite soon. What's going on with these? You want one? <laughs> yeah. I mean, They're gross. Want <laughs> Wait, what about these ones? That looks like a better flavor. These are spearmint, but these are old. Oh, uh, those are new ones? New. Yo, hit me with one of the new ones. Kiwi yeah. watermelon. I'll hit a kiwi. You want a kiwi? Ooh, wee, I'll try a kiwi. Stop. <laughs> Don't, why would you put that in your video? Why do you? <laughs> that's embarrassing for you. For me? Yeah. That's embarrassing for me. <laughs> that's embarrassing it? for Ryan, not me. I don't care. Oh, mm. really oh wow. Oh. I'm gonna hit a double stack. That's delectable. <laughs> Is it an, an ooh wee? That's <laughs> oh good... wee, that's delectable. <laughs> ooh wee, that's a good kiwi. <laughs> that, is, that is embarrassing for me, right? <laughs> Stop. <laughs> Your car's got a uh, smell to it. A good one. Mm hmm No. Yeah. Stinks right now. Is it actually smelling? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Thank you. You want to stay and watch? Are you guys about to pull it right now? No. I mean, it's probably not going to work, but <laughs> the monster truck's broken. I mean, the monster truck's... It, that, that string's going to break. Wow, that was amazing. It actually started to move. We got it most of the way out. One more tug as as we reset the cable. We actually just walked that thing out. So all about snatch blocks and pulleys getting that mechanical advantage. Because the, uh, the dump truck couldn't straight pull it like that. So that was huge. Dumpy cam. I think she's about to come out. We're 
moving. I actually can't see the monster truck at all. I just know that we're moving, so it has to be coming up. We're gaining some speed. Okay, Matt says a little bit more. That thing walked it out. This thing's running hot. I was pushing as hard as I could, pulling everything she's got. She's smoking a little bit now. <laughs> she's hot. But uh, it, it walked it up that steep hill. I mean, if we had to live it here for a little while, that's a better wind than down in the, in the swamp where it's like, you know, in the mud and water. But that's good. That definitely exercised Dumpy. That was everything she had. Like, we're about home free. If we can just pull it up a little further, we can just pull it forward and tow, it, tow her over to the garage for uh, inspection yeah. next week. Oh, I can actually look at it right now. Let's take a look at this thing, guys. Look at the slop inside the tires. That is some serious stuff. Uh, One thing to keep in mind is it could, if like the park, yeah. well, it has a uh, transmission park. So if it just right. snaps, it's just gonna. Yeah, don't get run over. Yeah. Yeah, so this thing could be busted out pretty bad, or maybe it's uh, not as bad as we think. We don't know. Oh, wow. Look at the tire treads coming in and out. That's pretty wild. This thing is insane. I don't know. It's, there's just something about this truck, these monster trucks that are just so insane, so amazing. Like, just staring at it is just so cool. I found the problem. Oh, what is it? Where are you? I found the problem. It's really stupid. There's a little like metal line going to um, transmission cooler and it mm -hmm. wore through. Yeah, I just got like, rubbed. Yeah, this was gonna happen at some point anyway, just so happened to happen right there. Yeah. But it's like a massive hole in a hose, so all I gotta do is put a new line in, we're done, it's fixed. Assuming no additional damage happened after it started pouring out. Well, that's we didn't good. run it very long with after it started pouring out. Well, but that's why the fire, because the, the that line burst spray transmission fluid all over that exhaust on that side of the car and that the, the this pipe that's is what was on fire it was here but on the other side this uh, is, was on fire just it was doused in it uh, and the fluid was burning off of it huh. we got it out now we can just hook it up and hopefully just tow it straight back to the garages and we can hopefully fix it and see if the transmission's blown or if it's just as simple as what Matt says. But uh, all I know is this thing was literally dripping like lava. Like that was the craziest and scary thing, especially when you see your like friend in there and you was driving. He did happen to have a fire suit on only just because it looked cool, not because we thought I was going to catch on fire. But if it ever did and it was an issue, at least he'd be somewhat protected. And uh, he got out of there and it didn't catch on fire, but we're going to be better prepared next time. We have going to have fire extinguishers mounted everywhere, so like nothing's going to whistle and diesel on us. Last step is to uh, tow it. Let's see if it works. Drop it into gear. We got, dump we got Monster behind the dumpy. And we are going to just slowly get the tension on. The biggest thing Matt's fighting right now is can you turn those tires without powering the engine on, which means you have no power steering. Monster truck is moving. This is my review mirror. Seeing this thing just follow me. Oh, it's literally a huge monster. I'm towing it. So sick. Well, the dump truck isn't as like, glorious as a monster truck, but this thing is so fun. It's a big diesel, like, dumpy. I don't know. I just love driving this thing. Going through the new Team Rar gate. Team Rar gate. <laughs> yeah. Woo! We're picking up some steam now. We are just cruising. This is insane. Oh my gosh, that thing is so big. It barely fits. So we're going to try off road. This might be a mistake. But let's see. Can the monster truck make it? Uh oh. I was worried that was a bad idea. All right, we're gonna have to roll all the way down. This is bad. I got too excited. I was hoping this would work. I gotta stay on the pavement. Yes. Okay, I'm on pavement. Oh, we're pulling up to the cop car. This is insane. We are pulling this thing. Oh my gosh, Dumpy is revving hot. Oh, he almost hit the cop car. That's so funny. Okay, here it goes. It looks like he's on the road this time. He's got limited steering. I forgot that he had very limited steering because you can't turn it on. Oh, there it is. Yes. You can see him just working that power steering or lack thereof. 
just cranking manually those big tires with the steering wheel. Pretty crazy. That's pretty wild. Okay. I gotta be careful not to crash this thing. I cleared. And it looks like he's gonna probably clear as well. Although I can't see out that way. This is all I can see is what you guys can see right here. Okay, I think we're clear. Oh, he's gonna come in for the garage. Oh, that under 210. Jeez, oh, pieces. How was that turning that was the wheels? Arm workout. I believe it. I saw you like standing up on that. That was a lot, but it's here. I didn't think it was going to work. It's nice when your mud bog is just the length of the driveway away. Yeah, right? Can you imagine? If this is at Busco or something. You have to bring your home from Busco. Ugh. Ugh. Exhaust. Yeah, it's good that we tested here because we can it's get this here. thing, you know, off property ready. It moves all the way up to there. <laughs> I don't know what that is. It can't be right. <laughs> That uh, definitely can't be right. Has to be. Well, let's put it this way. The shackles are actually in a more proper position. What? The, this is correct. Yeah. Or more correct. More correct, I mean, yeah. the, Before they were flattened, so now we, we regained. Okay. We fixed it. Probably because we had to just shift everything. Oh, boy. Ooh, wee. I'll try a kiwi. Stop. 